I haven't played any of Just Cause. You just just get it, dude. <laughs> just get it. Why? Like, just Cause. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I just usually, like, if I see, like, a seam sale, I'm like, alright, I'll buy it. But, like, I'm just usually so busy with shit. I know, but it's just, it's one of those games that's, what the fuck? Is there no way to open this? Uh, what? I'm just crawling under that bed. What did it say? Is it, said, like, head to ES? Yeah, I think it's just have, like, have to escape. Oh, wait, was there a pain puzzle? Yeah, I think so. I don't... You know, I, I really like Resident Evil games, but the one thing I really need to fucking figure out is... How many people are just super into puzzles that they make the security in their house all puzzles? Would you make your house full of puzzles? No, I wouldn't make it full of <laughs> fucking puzzles. Like this? Like, if you have, like, a secret bookcase... Pull the red rope... Pull the red rope to push the the bookcase. Behind the bookcase will reveal a, that, that's in a we'll reveal one blue gem. I'm like, oh <coughs> it'll reveal one blue gem. And your blue gem you can you can put into the statue. But if you put in the red gem, if you pull the wrong lever, you'll die. Like I would never make that a security to book. Why are you trying to? I don't know if that I could go through that door because it's open. Yeah, my stomach's been growling a lot. It's probably because like you ate that pizza. I yeah, that pizza. No, pizza. like pizza. The thing about like working like I work like night shifts. Yeah. And like as I sleep through the day, and I wake up like in the afternoon or like in like during the around like dinner time or lunch time, yeah. my body feels like oh you should eat breakfast. But like I eat like lunch and dinner, and it's like, oh, okay, like <laughs> yeah, it's like ooh. <laughs> I don't know, cause like there's sometimes I'll be like I'm not hungry, I don't feel like hungry, and it's like now I'm really hungry. It's like I don't know, it just feels weird, and hopefully soon I can just get a, a normal day job and oh, just. Man. Don't have to worry about, cause like I heard like, uh, night shifts can like ruin your health and stuff. I don't think it ruins your health. I just think it makes you prone to. Like I did research, like oh, I, like it, it can get like heart disease and like cancer and shit. I'm like, all right, well, like I understand like if you're like forty, yeah, but like if it, like in your early twenties and whoa, zombie right there, Jesus, just <laughs> he's not wearing shoes. <laughs> That first shot, you didn't hit him. That was weird. Like, I, I saw it hit the ground, yeah. but there's blood on the ground, so I was like, oh, so I guess you hit him. Does, does your dad, like, knows, like, any, like, technology? Is he, like, one of those old people, like, that doesn't know, like, how to run a computer? No, he does. He uses an iPad. Oh, really? Yeah, he loves the iPad. Does he, like, play, like, those Facebook games or whatever? No, like, he doesn't do that. He just uses it for, like, YouTube and... I don't know. I feel like in our generation, when we get old, and they're just like, oh, they always, like, they're... Facebook and their YouTube. Like, they're always they're, dude, when we're old, it, it's gonna be really weird because they're gonna have like mind computers. They're gonna be like, Grandpa, why didn't you get the brain implant? And they'll be like, <laughs> I just stare at them like this, just literally like seriously. Yeah, everyone has a brain. Implant. Everybody has a brain implant. <laughs> yeah, if everybody had a fuck, if everybody jumped off a fucking bridge, would you do it too? I'd be that guy. <laughs> 
Dude, would you get a brain implant? They're like, they're like, all right, here's the selling pitch on it. It's totally secure. You, you know what's that's scary? when you, you know, know what's scary that it can actually happen. It, no, it probably is it, gonna happen. Yeah, it's the- <laughs> but that's the thing though. That's the first part. You know, that's the best part. Is it's it's really secure. That's when they tell you. That's when they are telling you right up front. Like it's probably not that secure. <laughs> Just like that would be the that would be the pitch. It's like it's really secure. You know, it's painless. It's probably really painful. The recovery period is like six to eight weeks. <laughs> um, you can just use the computer with your brain instead of having to have a computer in your house. <laughs> so you it's just like, sit in the chair like, and you're just like... It's called the eye brain. <laughs> like, just... <laughs> Eventually it would get better. I mean, if it was like fucking crazy, like 2029, 20, <laughs> and they were like, dude, we've had brain implant technology for like 150 years, I'd be like, okay, maybe I'll get a brain implant. 2029. 20, but if it's Gen 1 brain brain implants... First gen, I ain't doing it. Come here. Come on. Come on. Twenty twenty nine. I think that's like. Oh, this is like the part. Uh, whoa, the shadows. I just noticed like the shadows, like whoa, it's like really skinny. Cussing. It's a cut. <laughs> Shit. He's dead. He shoot himself. The. I love that the telephone cussing. I cannot stop laughing about that. The what? Kevin on the the. It was like the walkie-talkie. It's like what? Huh? Okay. Shit. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Did you find look, it? Look, look at the shadow figures. Like, this, it looks really skinny. It looks really scary. I just, like, notice it, like... Just, like, the little detail of the game. I wonder how long they make this game. The Probably, like, five days. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, with, with five people, made it in five games, or five days. Yeah, they made five games in five days. Five games, five days. That'd be a cool fucking challenge. That'd be fucking hard. What? How much money would you make, though? A lot. So, shut the fuck up. Dude, there are so I many games coming out this year. Do you realize that? Like, if anybody listening to this is thinking, should I go play your talking console? About, are you talking about, like, this this year? Or, like... Like, 2016. This oh. year is over for video games. Okay. Well, pretty much, like... Like, E3 during the summer is like, alright, this is what's going to come out at the end of this year, or the beginning of this year. End of this year, beginning of next. That's That's where, like, you know, you can get all these cool games, and then we won't, we won't see you till next year. Yeah. <laughs> see you next year, I think. Uncharted's cool. I, I don't know if you've played that. I haven't even played any of that, You should play it. We should play it here. Oh, yeah, we should. I will totally play that again. You want to you do, like, a one through four? Let's just do all of them. Is it is it all in order, or is it just like is it like Metal Gear story? Oh, it's all it's all okay. It's all great in order. So it's not like Metal Gear where it's like oh you gotta play yeah like one one. one's kind of boring. I thought so anyway. I mean in comparison, which one? Like Uncharted One is like the most boring. Oh really? Say, yeah. 
Uncharted 2 is really fucking good. I, I heard, Uncharted that, 3 is I heard that's your favorite one. That's my favorite one, yeah. May and then Uncharted... Um, Uncharted 3 was kind of okay, and then Uncharted 4, I don't know, I haven't played. Huh. Yep. But I'm excited to... <laughs> Yoko. Yoko. Oh, Yo no. Yoko. Oh, here. Dave. What the <laughs> What the fuck? But, uh, I'm considering getting an Xbox One. Really? Yeah. Consider. Oh yeah, because you sold your Wii U. Yeah, I don't. I don't May like I the Wii U. It it's alright. I don't. I just feel like it's dead. Like Nintendo or just. No, the Wii U is dead. Because they're already talking about making another console. Uh, that that's not gonna that's not gonna help them. No, that's what I that's what I thought as well. It's like it's oversaturating the market. Like, is it, right now? They just need. They're to... they're leaning towards like Sega, where it's like, hey, this is a Sega Saturn. And then that's gonna be like that one where it's not gonna make any money. The and then they're gonna make the another console. Cast. No, no, they're gonna make they're gonna make that next console, which is gonna be like that Sega Siren. But that's not gonna sell. And then they're gonna make another console, and that's gonna probably be the end of them. Yeah. Eventually they're gonna they're gonna they're gonna fuck up somewhere down the line, and then they're gonna get bought up by like Sony. Like Microsoft now bought Mario. It's like what the fuck? I would quit. Oh god. If I was Nintendo, I would I'd rather let my my asset forever be lost into never being made again than given to Microsoft. Yeah. I would yeah. rather let I would rather let Mario be cast forever into hell <laughs> than to ever let Microsoft have it. They're both the same. Did you find anything? Oh, so my uh my little brother did the fan duel. Have you ever heard about FanDuel? It's like the it's sort of like the gambling of fantasy football and basketball. So like Jack did it. Like he did the like he he did like my mom gave him five dollars. So he did the five Oh boy. Yeah, but but guess what? He made twenty five dollars he when he won that. Bullshit. No, I saw it too. Yeah. And like, he, what do you do? You just he picked a team and he picked the right one. So like, you get like a certain amount of money, and like you buy like each player. But like, like, like say like the best player is is gonna cost like most of your your money in total. Yeah. So like, you better have like a good decent amount of team with like with all the price you you pay. So and then you wait you play for like it's like a it's like a one day kind of thing, and like whoever makes the most, like. It's it's kind of like a prize pool, pretty much. Like whoever makes the most gets like this much, and then like second place this much, third place this much, this much. But like Jack, like kept winning, and like I, I sort of I sort of like help him a little bit more, because like I know I know like fantasy basketball, but not much about football, and like he kept like winning like oh, some money, like he's like making progress. I'm like wow, he's actually like doing pretty decent. So now all he does is just watch sports and. Well, he does. He he always does. It's just make money. Yeah. Crazy. I mean, like if I was like his age, I would totally do that. Like. I mean, yeah. If I had nothing going on. Cause like you're a 15 year old teenager. He's 15. Man. I know. So crazy. Does it make you feel old? It does, dude. I remember when he like fucking <laughs> did some weird shit. The kid's done some weird stuff. <laughs> dude, there's this one time. I'm just gonna tell an embarrassing story about Jack, fuck it. One time I was going over to Jake's house, at uh, I don't know, we were like, maybe like 10 or 11 or something, and then Jack just like, comes out of the bathroom and he's naked, and he's like running around the house, and I think it was your mom was trying to like catch him, and he just wouldn't like get, he wouldn't get caught, dude. He just kept like jumping on the couch and he'd like shake his dick, dude. <laughs> that was the funniest thing ever. And he would just, like, your mom would just be like, Jack, stop! And he's just running around the house, dude. It was weird. <laughs> if you listen to this, you'd be like, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> if he doesn't remember, I, I do. I was there. I saw it. I don't remember it. You don't? No. How do you not remember that? I'm old. I remember a lot of shit. Jack's do done you? a lot of weird shit. I remember a lot of shit. I just don't remember that. I don't remember how you wouldn't. There was because I don't think about dicks. <laughs> no, I just remember Jack running out of your fucking like bathroom, just like laughing and like running around naked. And I was like, "What the fuck?" How old? How old is he? Was I he? I don't know. He was young as fuck though. And we were like ten. Uh -huh. We were like wicked young. 
I don't know, maybe 10. 10? W? We were still playing the N64. So however old he was then, <laughs> it was before the GameCube. I had, an, I had the Nintendo 64 in 2000. That was, that was the year he he was born. So he would probably be able to be like two. He was like two, yeah. Or maybe, three. Maybe he was two or three then. Yeah. But it was funny, dude. When did the GameCube come out? I don't know. Like 2002? Like, was it like four? 2004? 2003, no, wait. No, it came out like 2002 then. Yeah. Wow. Wait, when did the Town 64 came out? Like 1990. Oh, okay. I was like, <laughs> wait. I was like, wait, did it really came out in 2000? No. Uh, but that uh, that was no. a, that was the year I got it. Wait, you got an N64 in 2000? Yeah. It was on my 8th birthday, which does in 2000. <laughs> it was it was like one of like those awesome birthdays cuz it was like I had like a Pokemon birthday and I had like a Pokéball cake and there was like another cake. And my pre my birthday gift was an Nintendo sixty four. That's pretty cool. I was like I was like I was like, I was like that kid that was like that kid from Christmas. I was like, oh my god, Nintendo sixty four, <laughs> like that that Christmas kid one. Nintendo but, dude, I don't know. But I think that like came out two thousand two. Did it not tell you? Doesn't say like right off the bat. 2001, September, uh, November 18th, 2001 is when it first came out. Wow. 2001. Yeah, and I got it in 2002, so. Yeah. <coughs> I got the black version one, which I was pretty pumped about. I got the purple one. I had like two or three GameCubes. I've always like bought and sold Nintendo consoles multiple times. You have you you always like. I can't decide if I want it or I don't. I mean, I like the games when I play them, but then like. After I mean, you want... sold that fucking Wii U, so. <laughs> no, dude. <laughs> Didn't you bought a Wii, like a, the original Wii? Yeah. And then you sold <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, dude, I sold that for like. At least you saw that Nintendo sixty four console. I, that's, I'm never getting rid of that. It's mine. I hope not. Forever. I, I really hope you don't. <laughs> <laughs> so evidently. Nintendo NX is the new system name. Nintendo NX? Yeah. I guess that's what... What's the mean. NX stands for? Nobody says. Nobody extreme? Or <laughs> right. Nothing. Nothing. Nothing extreme? Nothing extreme. <laughs> I hope they do that. I think what it means is like Nintendo Cross. Because the, the point is like you're going to be able to play like the Wii... Wii games. And like Wii games and shit like that on the console, and then you can take that anywhere too. Oh, we might as well just tell the other news about uh, Super Smash Bros. Yeah. About Cloud. It's now. Oh yeah, that's not real, is it? That no, that is real. That's real. Yeah. Oh. It's a, it's a DLC now. Is it out right now? I don't I don't know, but now they have to. This is it. The only possible way they have to do now is make like. Final Fantasy 7 on the Wii U. You can't you can't put a Sony character in a Smash Bro unless you have a game for it. Like like people are like, well what about Snake? He was in Yeah, he was in. Yeah, remember the twin snakes on yeah. the GameCube? He was in that. He got permission. They got permission from Konami. Yeah. So like they had to put something like a like a Final Fantasy 7 game. They had to do something with relatable to the cloud. Yeah. The rumor is that I think they're going to put it on the NX in Final Fantasy VII. Oh. Uh -huh. I don't know, though. You can't, you can't just put, like, that character from God of War in Smash Bros. Like, that's... That'd be that, cool. That'd... That'd be cool. <laughs> just if it was a random encounter. Yeah. DLC, like, just update comes out and you're just, like, playing the game. And you're, instead of fighting the Master Hand, just Kratos comes in. <laughs> you have forsaken... <laughs> what are you talking about?
Whoa. It's like, whoa, those, oh, those hornets. Oh, ah! <laughs> oh. Yeah, they poison you. Don't they fuck you? Yeah. Oh yeah, because I mentioned it's like you got. Please don't get hit. You're gonna get poisoned, and then you get hit. I'm like, fucking a, just. <laughs> because no, I, I know what you did. You say back. And you're telling telling Dave, come on, because if he gets hit, then he'll die. He, yeah. Because he's not like Jim. <laughs> yeah. So now I'm poisoned. Ugh. Wait, ooh. You notice how, like, you get poisoned, your virus stops? Yeah. I wonder why. It's still stick on the last weird. Although I did take that pill. Oh, you just took every. Holy shit. There's three of them there. I literally ran away. I was like, <laughs> okay, there's too many. <laughs> Fuck. Flimsy door. I'm like, I can break this door. What do you think about the Resident Evil fixed cameras? Do you think that was like a cool? I liked the fixed cameras, honestly. Ooh. I didn't see that before. You just like hold his face and then like shoot him right in the head. Yeah. Wasn't Dave in that same room as you? Yeah, and he, he just ran away. and you just took the whole Took everybody out, man. <laughs> <laughs> he ran. Where were you? Because he's a bitch. I had a knife. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> what happened to Yoko? She's dead. There he is. Look, <laughs> look, he has a knife out too. And you're just like, oh shit. He's hiding. He's finding. He's like, where are you? <laughs> da, 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 da. He's like, get out of the closet. <laughs> get out of the closet. I like how we don't even know what's going on. I think I, I think I do. I don't. I don't care. Like, pretty much the whole scenario, like, he, that scientist guy, he let in that beast. Yep. Like, he's the guy who did the, in, like, the virus of all the... He's the one who fucked us all up. He's like, hey, I'm gonna be that guy who, uh, caused a virus and... I'm gonna, be that guy, I'm gonna be that guy that kills everybody. Remember that movie Quarantine? Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's what it kind of reminds me of. I guess. Have you, what's, uh, what's weird though is that I watched the Spanish version, which is called Record. Yeah. And it, it, it was, it was before Quarantine, and Quarantine hasn't came out yet during that time. Quarantine's a remake, isn't it? Yeah, of that movie. Uh. I guess that movie's like much scarier than the, uh, the Spanish version. Yeah, cause like the reporter is, the reporter looks like Shakira, which it was pretty weird, but it's kind of cool. It's like, that's weird. It's like, it's like, oh man, zombies, uh, my hips don't lie. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> my hips Oh, I think there was like a... Oh, the cameraman was Pedro. Or, yeah, it was Pedro. And he and she keeps saying, like, Pedro over and over and over. It's like, this guy must... It, like, he, and, uh... He's just like some, like, Latino guy. Like a typical, like... Latino. She's getting harassed by this young, pretty woman that... Yeah. Pedro. She hates... I remember the the quarantine cameraman was like a skinny black guy. Yeah. But like he didn't have like a cool name. No, but, like, she just never really said his name. I, I think, think he did, or she did. But that's pretty bad. I hate I hate that about American I, movies sometimes is that we just like to steal ideas. I think our, our like our movies just get like watered down. Like I heard like there's a a Playmobil. Oh, movie. dude, I heard about that, too. I yeah. really hope that was a joke. No. I heard there's, like, a movie about Monopoly. What? Yeah. Like, how low are we gonna go? Like, <laughs> There's an Angry Birds movie. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, it's really sad. What was his name? Jason something. I'm not watching it. Jason Sudeikis. He's in it. Nope, I'm not watching it. Yeah. Do you know that guy did the voice? He's like the narrator of Applebee's. I don't want to know. Really? Yeah. <laughs> you know, I don't want to know, really. <laughs> Applebee's? The commercials? Yeah. yeah. I'm like, why are you doing it? For like extra money? Like, is celebrities getting really desperate sad. now? Like, it's really sad, 
Is our economy that bad? Norm Norm McDonald, the comedian, is the fucking colonel now for Colonel Sanders. Wow. For KFC, he's Colonel fucking Sanders now. Mm-hmm. The guy in the fucking Adam Sandler movies, man. Jesus. I know. At least it wasn't Adam Sandler being the colonel. <laughs> oh. As- <laughs> Adam always does that like thing with his hand. Oh. He's- <laughs> what? Did you ever see that like? Oh man, I can't remember. Why who is he still making movies? Somebody sent like, what? Why is he still making movies? I don't know. But somebody told me that like Adam Sandler predicted some really weird shit. Really? Yeah, like tragedies. Hold right, on, look it up. Why can he be like Mike Myers, where he's just like, alright, that movie was terrible, I'm gonna stop. Like the cat in the hat. Honestly, I haven't seen Mike Myers make a movie yeah, in a while. Yeah, like the cat in the hat, that's where he's just like, alright, that movie was dumb. <clears throat> um, I'm, I'm gonna end my career now. <laughs> where Adam Sandler's like, hey, you know that Pixels movie? Where the fuck is he? Have you seen that movie? What is it, the Pixels? No, I haven't. <laughs> I, I saw the trailer for it, it looked pretty good. Oh, I, I kind of want to see it, just because uh, Sean Bean's in it. Sean Bean's in that movie? Yeah. I, I think he's a cop. There's I just, just want to see if he dies or not, that's all I, that's all I care. It, and I'll kind of be disappointed if he doesn't die in that movie. Like, I want to see him get eat by, eaten by Pac-Man. Just like another list of how he died. <laughs> I think I think getting trampled uh, getting trampled by sheaves is the best one he died. <laughs> that's like the that's like the funniest thing I ever like. Oh, it's like one of his like his early career movies. It's I think it's like a Scottish movie or something like that. Isn't he Scottish though? Who? Sean Bean. No, I think he's English actually. Yeah. So I'm looking at, I'm looking at Mike Myers, like history. What, what was his last movie? All right, so his legit last movie. 